Hey guys, Jack here. We're at the March for Science here in Washington, D.C. There are thousands of people here marching for science. And of the thousands of people, we have Planetary Society board member and star of Star Trek Voyager, Robert Picardo. Thank you, Jack. It's very exciting to be here. There's always the fear that no one's going to show up. That fear has disappeared. There are thousands and thousands of people here, and there's a tremendous feeling of excitement. Before we walk to the stage, our so why are you marching? I am marching because one of the benefits of having starred in the Star Trek series is I am constantly put in the company of people who credit Star Trek uh, for inspiration in our careers they would introduce science, technology, exploration, engineering, whatever. I've had the honor of sitting on stage with five men who walked on the moon. I've had all these crazy opportunities to meet heroes in science and exploration, and I have absolutely uh, it's restoked my own personal passion for science. It came from my childhood when I was a biology major and intended to be a real doctor, and not just a television. <laughs> well, I think I speak for myself, Newton, and a lot of our fans at Ad Astra that you are an inspiration to us. Thank you. Thank you for being out here. I, I appreciate it. I'm really proud to be part of the Planetary Society. Honored that they asked me to join the executive board with our fearless leader, Bill Nye. Uh, I'm, the, I'm the least credentialed person sitting at that board table, and I couldn't be happier. <laughs> Make sure you check out next week's episode of Ad Astra for our take on the market science. Thanks, guys.